New reports reveal that ties between the DNC and high-profile corruption in Russia resulted in the fake Russian collusion narrative. One America's Christian Rose has that report. A new report reveals a co-founder of Fusion GPS, the company behind the debunked Trump dossier, met with Russian lawyer Natalia Veselnitskaya just hours ahead of her meeting with Donald Trump Jr. at Trump Tower. Fusion GPS was co-founded as an opposition research firm back in 2011 by Glenn Simpson, a former investigative reporter for the Wall Street Journal. The meeting between Simpson and Veselnitskaya took place just 11 days before the first Trump dossier memo was written. This could shed light on how the Trump dossier was manufactured. Founder Glenn Simpson is refusing to cooperate with this company's, uh, committee's invest, investigation and inquiry. His company is also the subject of a complaint to the Justice Department. That complaint alleges that Fusion worked as an unregistered foreign agent for Russian interests and with a former Russian intelligence agency at the time it worked on the dossier. According to earlier reports, Fusion GPS put the document together with funding from Hillary Clinton's presidential campaign and the DNC, while the dossier itself was authored by British spy Christopher Steele. Simpson reportedly had at least two encounters with Veselnitskaya immediately before and after her well-publicized meeting last year with Donald Trump Jr. Fusion GPS subsequently denied it was aware of any of the Russian lawyers' meetings. However, Fusion GPS was working with Veselnitskaya at the same time, seeking to dismantle the Magnitsky Act, which blacklists several corrupt Russian officials and businessmen, preventing them from doing business in the US. Around that same time, Fusion GPS was also working for a Russian businessman who wanted to be removed from the Magnitsky Act's list of sanctioned individuals. According to New York Times reporter Ken Vogel, Fusion GPS had worked with Russian business interests for years. This makes the context between Simpson and Veselnitskaya increasingly relevant as Fusion GPS was working for the DNC, the Clinton campaign and Russian interests all at the same time. Fusion GPS paid Steele $168,000 to fabricate the Trump dossier, some memos of which went to the FBI in mid-2016. This means not only was the Trump dossier manufactured with the DNC and the Clintons funding, its creation also involved funds gathered from high-level corruption in Russia. No, you believe Fusion GPS is actually backed by the Russians. They're trying to create, find dirt on Trump. Uh, you believe this Russian lawyer, Natalia, is working with the Russians. Uh, she has been introduced to Don Jr. by a business partner of the Trump saying the Russian government's behind you. They want to help you. You need to meet with this lady. That's kind of that's kind of interesting. Meanwhile, most of the collusion narrative, namely the allegations Veselnitska had dirt on Clinton and the dossier itself, was put together by two British nationals. The fake collusion narrative has been used multiple times during the past year to undermine the Trump administration, which corresponds to the globalist corruption agenda of the political left, possibly suggesting the FBI investigation could take another turn. Christian Rose, One American News.